Okay, so several days ago, I actually shared my makeup, my like very light makeup. Step one will be like every day. So every day you have to do your skin care very, very carefully, and you have to know your skin very much. My skin is kind of combination and I have some pimples right here. It's kind of sensitive skin. I know I can really try a lot of, you know, like fancy skincare products. Only use the like organic, the natural products. Very hard. It's not really hard, but you have to do like skincare routine every single day. And you have to know what exactly your skin needs. For 10 minutes, I will finish my makeup in 10 minutes. Get a start. I will use the Hana organic, uh, organic what? Okay, this is a whatever. So it's just for sunscreen. Suns sunscreen. In May, I went to Japan and I got a lot of you know any product I really love. So I just use like very simple, and I use my finger like a massage. So um, so in my opinion. The organic skin is really really good, but if you have skin problem, it cannot really cover up. It's actually my everyday, everyday. It's actually my everyday thing. I don't really, you know, I don't really use the brush or sponge for my everyday because sometimes I feel I will forgot to clean my brush and sponge. And that's the most important part of your skin. It's kind of, I only use a little bit foundation where I feel I need this a little bit on my eyelid, my forehead. So if you have very good, I mean the healthy skin, you don't have to spend that much time. And I want my skin is like healthy glow. Okay, I feel I I feel like more maybe more tired recently, so I will like add more foundation. Okay, that's it. Have my primer on. Uh, not my primer. <laughs> have the powder on, and I prefer the the loose powder because I want my skin is more like cool, healthy look this time. It's a little bit of dirt on the eyes. Well, I actually um, did the eyebrow tattoo by Zizana. Yeah, this in Vancouver. So a lot of people just ask me where I did my eyebrows, and I say, oh, I think Canada, Vancouver. And I say, I'm sorry, but I I really love the result. It brushy, hairy eyebrows. Then the blush is really make the change. So it's kind of like orange and a little bit pink. I prefer doing this way instead of like rounded blush because I I want um use the contour the bronzer this way of applying the blush would really change my face shape. We are Asian. So our face more flat. I will add more shadow here around nose and my eyes. And I use this one, it's from Tarte. It's a travel size. I really love this one. And it's really like safe the space of your room. We'll add a little bit. Remember just a little bit here. Then I will use the Becca 
highlighter. I will just use like whatever, maybe the pink or gold. It uh, highlight my skin. And I will use my finger very easily apply my eyes. And I will check a mirror a bit more shadow here. Finish here. Okay, it's from Urban Decay. Ah, 10 minutes. Yeah, done. I really love this one. Waterproof and smudge proof. So, and then my hair is like. Whatever you know, it's more darker than under the sun, and I will use the Cry Baby Serum hair serum with long hair. This smells so good. Gloss on this. Okay, so I done this look. It's very easy, right? <laughs> so it's actually my everyday look because I I don't want to spend like too much time on my makeup on myself because I love. I have a lot of work to do. The exciting news about I going to uh, publish my travel book, my first travel book in 2020. And by yeah, still like a week, a week. I have a seven days more to no, it's not seven days more. Maybe like five days more to to pack my luggage. Crazy. Yeah, I gonna go to Paris around July 12th, I think so. Yeah, I'll spend a month in France. You know, we have a lot of information in our DK. So um, I'd love to hear about where to eat, where to visit, or anything about. Um, I love to hear like crazy ideas. And I love and I'm really exciting to have the travel book with you. It's for everybody, it's for you. And I hope you like this video. And see you next time. It's like crazy easy makeup every day. <laughs> Bye! My secret is I feel very unsafe if I only apply the foundation without eye makeup but now I just feel very comfortable for now because it's a real me you know I don't want to like cover my eyes because I feel eye contact is really really important between you and me you know like between the people so if you want to like talk to uh, the person you really care or maybe you like and you want to like you know have a relationship it's really important to have very clear like eye contact with him or her so that's why i just feel i'm really comfortable right now and i hope you really find the way 
you like to apply the makeup for every single day because it's for girls wait maybe you are a mom right now and you are super busy but trust me you have to spend time on yourself time is short and we have to love ourselves more right? <laughs> <laughs>